the roulette commands and a better chicken fight strategy. It should only be about a few minutes, so I'm going to get right into it. Um, so starting off, a lot of you guys probably haven't really realized this, but you can actually play other games, um, one of them being roulette. Now roulette has some really fun rules, and to start it off, you're going to type in command roulette 100 being your minimum bet, all the way up to all being your entire hand. You can do anything above 100 in this server, and in most servers for that matter. And so roulette has a, several different outcomes, several different bets you can place. You could do even odd, which you can bet on the evens. You could do roulette um, odd, which we will bet on the odds, which which is really cool because I can I can actually do double bet. So even though I've spent two hundred dollars on even, a hundred dollars on even, hundred dollars on odds, in twenty three seconds, I'm gonna win a two hundred dollars because I bet on the same thing. Um, but uh, so anyways, I digress. But roulette is kind of fun. You can do the the game here isn't to just place one bet. You're supposed to place multiple bets in a row and so you'll probably do like even odd black or red so i could do roulette 100 on the black space so see i i won because the ball landed on red seven right here in the middle it says red seven so i bet on odds hundred dollars on odds so i double my money so you can either do roulette black you could do this next one since um let's do another even actually because since the ball landed on seven i'm thinking that there's a chance that it's going to land on an even number so i'll do roulette 100 even and then you can also bet on uh, chunks. So you could do roulette. Uh, let's see here. Let's paste that. Let's do, we'll just do the first row. There's three rows, first, second, and third row. I'm going to bet on the first row. And if I win on the first row bet, I'll actually triple my money because it's a one in three chance of winning. Um, it looks like, hey, black 13 was actually on the first row. And so I got triple my 100. So I got 300 plus it was an even number. And so I got 200, so I've got a total of 500 coins. And so another bet would be um, you can bet 100 being the minimum, and then you could do 1 through 12. You could do 13 through 24, or you can do 25 through 36. And so essentially the, this bet will be placing on, instead of first row, second row, third row, you'll be betting on a series of numbers. So like I'm going to play, like let's see here. So the last ball was a 7. The next ball, um, sorry, two balls ago was 7. The next ball is a 13, um, and there's a total of 36 little slots this ball can land on, so I'm actually going to bet um, in one of those slots. I'm going to do 25 through 36. So I'm going to do roulette 100, 25 through 36, because, you know, if you think about it, if you keep spinning the ball enough times on, a thir on 36 blocks, there's a chance that the ball will spread out evenly, but that's not really how it works. I don't know. It's just all about odds, and so I'll play that, that, that corner there, and I always like to just kind of bet on even and odd, an even and an odd um, as well as a black or a red. So I'm going to bet black again. So I placed three bets, one being one and third, uh, 50 50, and a 50 50. And so you may win everything, you may lose everything. So I, I won I won the one third bet, which the ball landed on 31. I bet between 25 and 36. And it was odd, which I lost the even bet, but it was black. So I won the. the the black bet. So even though I spent 300 coins, I won 500, so I got a 200 coin profit. So that is the basics of roulette. There's a couple more commands. You can check out the the, clan to, the, the commands description to kind of give you a better understanding how that works. Uh, you can get a little more specific. If you have any questions, you can totally ask me. But that is the basic roulette commands. The tip here is to spread out your bets. Don't just place one, place multiple, and you'll end up winning a lot uh, because you just look at the patterns. 